right, guys, this is Dave from the Kodo, and we are back on my single player FTB Ultimate Pack. Uh, a couple of things I've been working on while I've been trying to finish out the mansion. So let me show you. <clears throat> As you can see in the background, you can see a little bit of the blue tricity. Um, I got that going. You know what? I'm gonna. This has been sitting here forever. I'm just gonna dig it up. For some reason, there's a little bit of lag, which is odd because it's on my own network, but. Um, one of the main changes you can see is that my little area is gone. But first, let's go up in here. Look at, boom, starting to fill out the top here. And as you can see, I have a, a jetpack. I've been doing a lot of work. Um, got the bees over here, got them going. Starting to put grass up here. This whole top area will be filled with grass eventually. Little stairway down here. Nothing, nothing new back there. Um, but we do have blue tricity going here. This, uh, that one is almost at 150, which is the level at which that's the most efficient. This one's obviously not as high. But um, got these two right here, and then bat boxes in between each one because the blue tricity wire loses energy after so many blocks. So every couple blocks we reset it with another battery box, and just these two alone. On top of those are doing a pretty good job. Uh, what I'd like to do is create a tower around this so it doesn't look so stupid. But <clears throat> down in here, you can see I'm starting to finish out the floor. And I've also got a little stairway here coming up. Uh, over here, I started working on some Thaumcraft. I'm going to burn through this, not on camera because it's freaking boring to watch. And then finish out more floor area over here and this is where I've been doing a lot of work right here got a bunch of the blue tricity um, machines this will obviously what is going on here turn that off see that's running that was running all night and it's still plenty of power there <laughs> phone was blowing up um, so these are what I was using to make energy and liquid tesseracts over here you can see I've been using the turtles to mine this area out. There was a skelly spawner in there. Oh wait, that's not the skelly spawner. There's one behind it. There was a um, zombie spawner in there. I soaked that up into, I think it's this one. Nope. Nope. It's one of these. I'll find it. I actually have no idea where it is. It's empty. I'll just bring these both down. Bam! There they are. Okay. So I've got a tier 5 zombie spawner, and I need to hit one more skeleton spawner to finish that out. Um, that will be the one that's underneath my base. I'll set those up with a turtle, and then it'll be good to go. So i got an MFE here. That... Uh, it's getting a little pull on it with energy tesseract right here this is connected over to the other side of the base so that I can have power this is full of lava it's a Zycraft tank full of lava they're huge and awesome with the liquid tesseract pumping into it all the time from the nether I haven't found a miscraft age yet it works what's this doing okay so I got these three powering this bat box and then transferring down. I may need to add more because those um, the energy tesseract is pulling a little harder than I want. So then we've got just the basic setup. This was all outside. That is the main big changes. What I want to do today is bring over here. As you can see, finishing off enchanting area right here, and then this is the energy tesseract into a squeezer, centrifuge, and a carpenter. I'd like to add some more um, apiaries, and I need to get some more wood going too, so it was already on there. 
Apiaries. Okay, that, that wood. Let's go get... You know what I need? I need at least one of these guys over here. So, let's see here. Apiary. There's that. That's six. Maybe that'll work. That's four. Get out of there, guy. Can we finish them all off? Yes, we can. Bam. Okay. So, I'm probably going to have to put stairs over here because this is going to be annoying to have to walk all the way back over here every time I want to go up. Maybe I'll just put a little hole. Ladder. So, like I said, this whole area is going to be full of apiaries because I want to get... Oops. I need to get the Imperial line. Am I skipping here? Two. Get the Imperial line, get the apiarists, pipes, all the works going. I did bring back some bees from one of my trips. Yes. I don't know how many other ones, but this will do. We got another Laporian drone. I don't know how, but it's there. Uh, for the time being, ah, we're going to add these in here. I need to get some more. I'm going to make it daytime. One sec. Okay. So it's daytime now. It's a lot of work to be finished in this. But uh, we're working on it. What I want to do, I'd like to get more of those set up. I'd like to get some of the... Sorry, my eyes twigging out. There we go. What do I need next? The B area. Let's set up a tank for honey. Because we're going to need a lot of honey and we're going to need um, the BNA. There's this. We'll take this. I'll bring that upstairs. Actually, I think I need it. Let's see. The valve. Yes, I do. And I need buckets. Oh, there's a couple of valves. I need honey and BNA holding. So, I need a couple. Do I have buckets on me? I have one. One, two, three. Four. Nope. Three. Okay, let's move this guy. Let's make uh, another bucket. Bam. The valve. Let's make a couple of these. Because I'm going to need a bunch of them anyway. Bam. Okay, so that's, that's five more tanks. That's a lot. That's fine. Go away, go away. Go away. You too. These ones I'm going to make probably out of the same stuff. I mean, I like the way that looks. I could make it out of out of wood. Let's make it out of wood. I think wood will work. But then this will allow me to have BNA as well as. Take that off, it's kind of annoying sometimes. BNA as well as honey stored up there by my bees. But I do need to get along the Imperial branch so that I can get to the point of making um, alvearies. Those are extremely, extremely important. different types of bees that I'm looking for. The 
mutators and whatnot. So let me get these cut down and I'll meet you back up by the B area. Okay. So <laughs> Tanks. If the B and A, probably gonna go on this wall, I think, and this will work out. Watch this. So what we'll do is we'll use this top as the top of it. That'll work out perfectly. stuff will go right along here and it'll need room to go behind <laughs> and I'm thinking can't be one of the inside pieces so right here See, that's going to act like the roof of it. The in. The veil just can't be one of the side pieces. Put the in right there. So the, all the stuff will be squeezing and pushing in, all the way over and bop right into there. I'll be able to look in right here. That'll show me all the stuff. There we go. And that'll hold a decent amount of honey or BNA. Didn't really plan out this. Once I find more books, I'll just chop it down. It's not like a big deal. I need to find a bigger supply of cows, though. Biggest problem I was having was finding electricity. Okay, sorry about that. Oh. There we go. Had a little uh, recording glitch there. Had to restart. So, let me just make it daytime. And let's finish off those two things. Uh, I'm gonna need glass. And possibly get some honey going. Massive lag. There we go. Um, so those will be for honey and bees. And I didn't have a grafter, but that's fine. I'll get one. So, uh, oh yeah, we're gonna do this. No, we're gonna use the liquid ducks. Harden and copper. I got that. I actually think the hardens in here. Nope. I 
Oh, there's glass too. I'm going to need you. There it is. And then copper. There we go. So this it's four. Bam. That should be good. If we need more, we got it. <clears throat> okay. To finish this off, let's get uh these bees rotating again. Pull that guy out. These guys just refuse to change. Princess is what I need to change. But they refuse. And those ones are going to end up turning into DNA. There we go. There we go. And there we go. So <clears throat> let's go over here. Let's finish off this. One for honey, one for BNA. Right click you. What the heck happened? missing. Let me if I get rid of those. What's missing? Get what's broken. Doesn't work fine. Oh, it's that block. Okay. So you can't be that block. So for the time being, you will have to sit there. turn on. Yep, there we go. Perfect. So now Centrifuge is going to have to move. We're going to want you Let's go with Right there. I'm going to need another squeezer. Because I can't have seed oil. But we'll change it later. stuff so let me find that and I'll be right back okay so apparently I'm all out of that energy conduit so no big deal we'll make the best out of it we'll get this set up right here and then I'll dump into there I think that'll work And then what I'll do is I'll just run. Oops. I'll run buildcraft piping along the backside for the other one. And that'll work. Unless I bring this out a little bit, which I might do. That's what I'll do. Bring us out a level, then 
I can run a level right here and then a build craft one in the middle if I need it. So that's what it'll do. We'll squeeze the honey drops for honey, fill this up, then we're good. So for now, put those in there. That's what's going to happen. I will make uh, more of the energy to connect them all, and then we'll be good. I'll make some more beehives too, or apiaries. So stay tuned for the next episode. Thank you for tuning in for this one. I'm Dave from the Kodo. Like always, good luck and have fun.